going to crash! Hey guys, it's Gabriella, and welcome back to another scary text message story. Today we're playing My Creepy Bus Driver Kidnapped Me Over Christmas Break. The last place you want to be during the Christmas holiday is on a school bus. Let's jump right in and see what's going to happen. 7.45 a.m. Rosa, where is everyone? Hannah, what do you mean? I'm the only one on the school bus. You're on the school bus? But it's the Christmas holiday! OMG, I forgot! So how come I was picked up today? Are you sure it's a school bus? It's big, and yellow, and has the name of our school along the side. Is it the regular driver? No, it's a new guy. He's creeping me out. He keeps glaring at me in the rearview mirror. I wish he'd concentrate on the road. He nearly had a woman on the sidewalk. Maybe he's been drinking? You need to get off that bus. I can't if it's moving. Tell him you feel sick. Make something up. Just get off of that thing. I told him I was going to throw up. And? He told me to hold my breath and count to a thousand! That's impossible! You'd pass out! Wait, we're pulling over. Wait, where? Like, where is she if this bus isn't, like, going to school? The bus is stopping. Okay, now get off as quick as you can. I'm gonna leave through the rear door. Good idea. Are you off yet? The doors are locked! Call out to the driver. It's probably just a mechanical fault. We're making each other paranoid. You don't understand. There's a padlock on the door! Oh my god! Why? Why? What? I'm trapped! I can't get off the bus! And now the driver's shouting at me! What's he saying? He just keeps screaming, help! Gross! He's foaming at the mouth! Ew! Try the door at the front while he's screaming. I'll try, but... Hold on. Someone's getting on. Is it another student? There's no way he goes to our school. What do you mean? Who else should be getting on a school bus? Security wouldn't let him on the grounds. Just tell him you've been kidnapped, Rosa. He's not here to rescue me, Hannah. There's something very wrong with him. He's moving so strangely, jerking and twitching. Now he's rummaging through a plastic bag. He pulled out a bunch of flowers. What is happening? And gave them to the driver. Creepy. The driver's pretending to give him a bus ticket. It's like they're playing a game. Who are these people? I think you should play along and wait for a chance to escape. What's happening now? The twitching man sat down a few seats in front of me. Stand up and walk off the bus like everything is completely normal. Okay, I'm going. I'm making my way to the front. But the driver, he's shaking his finger at me in the rear view mirror. <laughs> this is so scary. He keeps pulling weird faces. I think he wants me to sit back down. You don't have to listen to him. No, but he looks so mad. He's gritting his teeth and biting his tongue. I can see blood trickling down his chin. Ew, what is happening to this man? I'm not going anywhere near that man. What direction is the driver heading? We're turning down Jefferson. That's not the way to the school. I don't think you're heading to school, Rosa. I think you're being taken somewhere else. What do I do now? Can you bang on the window for help? There's a car driving beside us. The kid in the back is looking at me. Get his attention! You need him to tell his parents. He's just waving at me. He thinks I'm trying to say hello. He's treating it like a game. Try not to panic, Rosa. There will be another car. We're slowing down. We're turning off Jefferson. New plan. Try talking to the other passengers. Or call the police! What shall I say? Start with hello. I asked him where he thinks the bus is going. And what did he say? Nothing. He's ignoring me. Get up and talk to him face to face. Okay, wish me luck. Good luck, Rosa. Well, that was a disaster. <laughs> me trying to do any social interaction. <laughs> what did he do? He just sat there. Oh my God. Look at the poor man! Why are you just taking pictures of people? Where's the bus now? We've taken another left. Look on your phone's GPS. We could be heading anywhere! Oh my gosh! Uh, maybe he's taking you to the museum? Like a field trip? I don't know! But I'm asking him to stop the bus. Well, what did he say? He just looked at me at the mirror and laughed. Then he said he's looking for someone. Who is he looking for? The rest of his friends! What? 
So you're still on the bus? Yes! There's no way he's gonna pull over. Where is he taking you now? We're back on Jefferson. I don't think he knows where he's going. But he did pick up another passenger. Who was it? Another scary man. In what way? In every way possible! He's freakishly tall and awkward looking with a shaven head and the darkest eyes you've ever seen. Not everyone looks perfect, Rosa. <laughs> now is not the time, Hannah! I know that! I wasn't just how he looks. What then? He walked right over to me and asked if I wanted to dance. He asked you to dance? What did you say? I started to cry. <laughs> You should never have gotten on a school bus. It's the Christmas holidays. But I was so tired this morning. Okay, so what did he do when you cried? He looked frightened and tried to stroke my hair. That is so creepy. I told him I just wanted to get off the bus, but he just sat down on the floor and rolled beneath the seats. He did what? He's under them now. <sighs> I can see his feet sticking out. This is so bizarre. That's not the worst of it. He told me where we're going. At last, where? I'll meet you there. Heaven. <gasps> did Rosa die? I've called the police. What did they say? They said they're looking out for the school bus. I hope they're quick. But what's happening now? I'm not sure. The driver said he can't find number four. What does that mean? I don't know, but he's getting agitated. He's driving way too fast and heading out of town. I've got an idea. Tell the driver you know where number four is. Tell him number four is at the mall. You've got a plan? There's a climate change protest today. It's in the mall car park. There'll be police all over the area. That might work. There's no plan B, Rosa. You, we need to make this work. Okay, I told him. He broke out in a huge grin. He's turning the bus around. We're going towards the mall. It's working. We're close to it. Good news at last. Not that good. Hannah, he's not slowing down. I can see the climate change protests. We're heading straight for them. Ah! Use the combination lock on the back door. But there are four numbers to choose from. Try one, two, three, four. It didn't work. Just keep trying. Are there any clues to what it might be? I can't think straight, Hannah. We're accelerating. And the driver keeps screaming, help. Help would be perfect right now. Oh, help, A-G-L, like that's four letters. Of course, help. Ah! What are you talking about? The letters on a phone number pad. Four, three, five, seven spells help. I have no idea what you're talking about. It doesn't matter, the numbers worked. I can open the door. You did it, Rosa. Not quite. We're speeding towards a wall! Hold on to something! What is happening? We're going to crash! What is happening? Ah. Hannah, good news, Rosa. The doctor said I can visit tomorrow. It'll be good to see you. Did the police speak to you yet? So wait, wait, was that real? Was it fake? Is she alive? Is she dead? They've only just left. What did they say? That four patients had escaped from a high-security psychiatric hospital. Police picked the fourth one hiding at Drake Mansion. <gasps> ah, that was from like the other story where they stay the night in Drake Mansion. Oh my gosh, if you haven't seen that one, watch that down below right after this one. And now they've got the third from the bus? Apparently they've only got two of them. <gasps> where are the other two? <gasps> one of the others was flung out of the door with me when the bus hit the wall. Is he dangerous? Well, none of them hurt me on purpose, but anyone can be dangerous in the right circumstance. The driver must have stolen the school bus. Anyway, one escaped the crash and, what's wrong? The bed beside me, there's somebody in it. You're in a hospital ward, Rosa. Everything's going to freak you out after the experience you've had. But it was empty when the police were here. Are you sure? What's happening? <laughs> you had a tough day. I'm supposed to be in a children's ward. You are, the doctors told me that's where to visit you tomorrow. Hannah, call the police. What's wrong, have you remembered something from the bus? You could say that.
guys, that was so good! If you loved it as much as I did, let me know down below in the comments and share this with a friend to spook them out as well. Until the next video, you guys, you can check out the awesome videos that I linked down below in the comments, but also on the screen. And I will see you guys later for another scary Texas story. Bye! Oh, that was so good!